Oh, we're right gonna off. kick it off, huh? Yeah, right off, right off to battlefield. Um, like this it. stage is a little interesting, actually, because uh, if the fox would want to camp the top platform, um, the ice climbers have a very hard time uh, getting up there and contesting anything that the opposing character wants to do. Right, of course. So it doesn't look like Kobol's going to utilize that, at least right now. Not yet. Uh, he's just going to kind of go in and utilize... Uh, His shines are really well yeah. placed. That, uh, just, whenever just they're hitting, fox. they're separating. Yeah. What a shine. Yeah. All right, doesn't get that one the way he wanted. Uh, a little late. Already tis down to, you know, Sopo at mm -hmm. 40 seconds into the match. But Ooh, what no, the stock lead's still even, so... Yeah, what a I tech, though. Interesting. Okay. Nice grab. No. I like the option he went oh. for and just fucks right. the grab. Yeah. They're both laughing about it. These yeah, two. it looked like he would have just grabbed the ledge if he didn't air, uh, air dodge. Right. He was probably trying to just wave land on the stage. So. Of course. Yeah, this matchup is definitely very hard for Ice Climbers. Um, oh, yeah. Just because, uh, of, like just we were saying with Abate uh, against Fork, is just Fox's stuff is if you're not messing up, like, it's all safe. Yeah, it's so, so like, he can just kind of so go good. in, and then, like, if he doesn't mess up, uh, he can essentially get a free split up. Yeah, it's going to be on Dizkid to kind of try to set the pace and just knock it over. Yeah, definitely. Um, so we'll see how, how he handles that. But already down, losing Nana again. That's it's gonna be rough. Not gonna be easy. I mm -hmm. uh, really just wouldn't quick even cancel. Okay, Ooh. go for either a quick. It, so this is like a weird situation. I think. I think you got two options as the icy Sopo. In that, in like you know, you're down almost to full stock, but you gotta go for either the quick gimp or just say whatever. I'm obviously not gonna get the kill. Uh, so whatever, just play safe. Really get as much out of it as you can. Uh, mm -hmm. Ooh, what a good. short to, yeah, to not uh, die. Yeah. <laughs> Kobo kind of known for his SDs. Um, so, good good thing he didn't there. Yeah, you how never, about you, that? You never want to see that. No, definitely not. Especially not. About to be a uh, winner is top eight, yes? Uh, to, well, top top 12, top 16. Okay. Right now. You right. would be, you know, this is for top eight. So. Yeah, that's wrong. Yeah. Mm. So. I don't, want, I don't want to see any uh, foul player. I don't want to see <laughs> someone get in off an SD. Yeah. Ooh, good give attack. Just wasn't really. expecting it. No, really. Split him up, and he's been kind of struggling to, you know, get back into it ever since. He does have to keep in mind that he is guarding that Nana. It's it's really hard to, I think, once Fox starts rolling through, to get that reset. Great ledge grab to, yeah. like, sneak in and... Uh, Contest what Kobo was trying to do. Just get up, so oh, get up that was a again. that was actually really cool. You kind of like knew what Nana was doing with the jabs there. Yeah. And it waited for Kobo to roll away. He didn't end up getting anything off of it. He kind of flubbed, but that just kind of shows you how well Diz knows this character. Oh yeah, definitely. And and also you know just how Ooh. people are gonna try to you know play as Nana. Of course. Yes. Or against Nana. I mean. Uh, very, so very good display. On, yeah, uh, definitely a very solid part. win from Kobol. Yep, for game one. See, you know, Diz shown some character knowledge, but it's not. You need a bit more to beat Kobol. Not enough to. Yeah, yeah. In a, in a losing matchup. Uh, no. Even. So. so still doable, but not the, not easy. Um, but it is only game one. I think. Uh, Diz has been looking real good these uh today. Last few uh tournaments I've seen him out. He looks like he's. Taking it up a notch, and that's that's what I want to see here. I want to see another game five. All right, I would care who it. wins. I would love to see another game five. Yeah, but we'll take it into the streets. I mean, right I now do. that's up to Diz to win. Uh, yep. To exactly. E at least even the, even the even the playing field. Even yeah. The scoreboard. Ooh, great grab. Uh, oh, interesting. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he, he knew he knew it was happening. <laughs> Flub the wobble to uh, SD. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, what a jab. There you go. Yeah, so we're already, assuming he doesn't drop this, yeah. this is already up two stocks, um, th you know, 30 seconds in. And that that's, uh, even though you've won last game as Kobol, that's still got to be a little disheartening. Uh, of course, you know, yeah. You definitely got to keep your head in the game. Just remember, like, well, I'm Fox. Yep. You know, let's, let's just, you know. If anything else, it's displayed twice that the threat is real, that you can still get wobbled. It doesn't matter how well you did that first game. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, both of these... The kills that first one was like kind of a wobble that led into some uh, awkward yeah. situation, but I mean, so far two wobbles in 30 seconds almost. 
Uh, it's just really big. You gotta, you Ooh. can't forget about the aim. Gets wow. him quick with that F smash. What a, yeah, because that was, it didn't look like I was gonna hit, and then uh, started the side B, and uh, side B, uh, like the hip, the hurt box. Ooh, that's, that, that was kind of goofy. <laughs> looked like he thought face. he was Nana at yeah. that point or uh, something. But uh, look, because the hurt box is. Uh, what? Way farther ahead than the uh, her, wow. uh, her boxes on the side. Yeah. So. I like what he did there. He went for that desync, let Nana do the throw off, so he had time himself to, to you know, read the edge guard situation, mm -hmm. and then just let into another wobble. That was good. That was really well played. Yeah. So that was like really solid answer from Diz. Yep. Um, the streets that'll do that. Oh, the streets. Oh man. But uh, Cobalt's got to be thinking good. Like, all right, you know, I got got my, it out I of the way. Two of my <laughs> counter picks. You know, FD's gone. Yep. You know. Um, you know, I only got to win two out of three right now. Of course. You know, and, you know, his ace in the hole is gone, so we're, st we're still sitting good. Absolutely. So we can. I'm talking about the last game, it looks like. <laughs> These two, oh my goodness. But really wonderful. Uh, I, I thought was he was oh. taking it back. <laughs> oh, man. That's <laughs> my actually, heart dropped uh, for a second. Yeah. Bold oh. call. But let's see what random. Brand, oh, okay, Brent Star. Craid. Yeah. The uh, this matchup on Onet is rather ridiculous. <laughs> Ready? Go. So Yoshi's. Uh, is that it? Right <laughs> off <laughs> the bat. Three seconds of the so Ice block, Blizzard grab. So yeah, I wow. actually. That's really tough. Like, you know. Like we were saying, like, oh, we're, you know, we're still good. Well, now you're down a full stock. Yeah. Right, I, at the, right off the bat. I'm telling you, if that's me, I'm, I'm mentally done. Oh, yeah, <laughs> exactly, yeah. <laughs> oh, so that's, you know, got to, Cobalt's definitely got to, you know, show, like, why he's a top player. You know yep. what I mean? Oh, and there it is. You know? Exactly, yeah. Did a very good option. Very patient, you know, baited out that getup attack, and then just ran in and even threw in a little charge. Go, I know I've got time for this. I know you're not going to kill me if I mess it up. Ooh, uh, and then just right off the bat, Nana's gone. Wow. What? Kobo's looking like he's, he's trying to just ignore that first stock and see if he can run away yeah, with definitely. Uh, interesting. And then with the stage, uh, the ceiling's so low, uh, you know, up throw, up air. Ice Climbers are one of the easier characters to do that on. To right. do that on. So that's gonna, gonna confirm for forever and kill pretty early. So. Of course. Ooh, my gosh. Already, man is living, like, for maybe three seconds, wow. you know? That's because that Diz definitely had that edge guard without Randall, and I think yep. Diz the, expected him to go to Randall. Yep, and Cobalt just kept going to the yeah. to the ledge. Yeah, it was, it so was a rough there. situation on uh, from Diz's point of view because uh, that's not a uh, a bad assumption to make mm -hmm. that Cobalt, someone of that caliber, is going to be able to play the Randall, is going to you know get that option, exactly. and then be in a terrible spot to try to edge guard. Mm -hmm. So it was really. It's a rough call. It's kind of all or nothing, and we saw how it's going for him. Is now right, there's yeah. a cold bowl that's 100%. I mean, he got the wobble finally, but what did he lose for yeah, it? Yeah, he's still down on stock. So. Yeah. Okay, though. So, yeah, he's definitely – so Diz has definitely got a – I would say – I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm just being a little biased, but I would say definitely playing as Ice Climbers is a little, little easier mentally than against – um, right. In this kind of situation. It's the, that fear aspect. But you still, yeah, you definitely still have to keep your head in the game. Yeah. Um, That's exactly what Cobalt did. He, yeah, Cobalt definitely bounced mm -hmm. back, just said, all right, all right, all right we're fine. Like, oh, whatever. I don't care. Nana's not going to live. I don't think Nana lived collectively like 15 seconds after that first, <laughs> uh, that first stock happened. Mm -hmm. It was just, he played an amazing job. His position, uh, positioning, excuse me, was great. Whenever he went in, he made sure he had a route to get out. He wasn't yeah, he didn't, you know, in he a didn't bad spot. Club. Yep. You know, that's the that's like you were saying, you know, ice climbers can all, almost be like a like a physical check, like how how are you pressing buttons today yeah. kind of thing. So you didn't flub at all that yeah. game. It looks good. And so. that was before I mean we even taken into the fact that Diz is playing really smart with a lot of these uh, scenarios. <clears throat> he, yeah. he's looking good, he's playing off Nana very well. We saw that um, you know, earlier in that uh, F D game a bit. Um, <clears throat> and so this definitely down yeah, but not out. On, mm. in Diz Kid yeah, you just got to win two games. Yep. There's a wobble. Th we got to, yeah. Exactly. So that was Very kind well of a placed. goofy air dodge. It almost looked like it was trying to get to the top platform. But <laughs> just staring <laughs> him down <laughs> while wobbling. <laughs> just <laughs> uh, 
And these two are laughing. They're talking about <laughs> Just it. Just isn't even paying attention. <laughs> They're having a <laughs> conversation. Oh, my goodness. Oh. <laughs> what gentlemen. Yeah, that was great. People. Love it. This is what I want to see. Like, yeah. it's high level melee. Oh, yeah. It's the, people that are having and especially fun. Especially, like, you know, at, like after that yeah, game two, like, oh, you know, you can get, you got like, kind of degenerate <laughs> into this mindset, like, well, okay, well, ice timers are really stupid. Like, I hate this game. I want to be playing right now. But, you know, like we said, Cobalt's always laughing. He's always having yeah. fun. And even against ice timers, we're yeah, good. Of course. So he keeping shows his, it there. His composure. Yep, gets that wobble and then already gets a good. Ooh, ooh, just he read read the roll in. It wasn't yep. in a quite a, quite a good enough position to, yep. to punish though. Yeah. Really? He had an opportunity to, to take take an anna away there. Yeah. Okay. Didn't quite capitalize. And that's going to be another one. All right, nice wobble setup from Diz. Um, yep. To essentially be up a stock right now. Of course. <laughs> No, so Dreamland really working to his his, uh, his favor uh, a good bit in, co in comparison to the last game. Right. There's a lot more room. He's not getting smothered as much. Of course. Which, oddly enough, I think it's like a double-edged sword because now you can't stick on the, the fox as much. Right. I mean, obviously, well, yeah. the same thing goes both ways. But so you also, Kobold kind of really isn't playing that style. Kobold's kind of just going in. You know yeah. what I mean? That's so true. I think that's a, a good like player counter pick. Yeah, I, I think so. And it's he's doing a very good job. Uh, Cobol is, excuse Ooh. me. That he's keeping them separated as we're seeing right here. And then when he gets to do something, right. Nana's dying. Uh, that's that's definitely going on. That's been a trend that he's been setting this whole set. Um, given the, the FD game was a little bit more difficult because you don't have those uh, platforms to retreat to off the shines. Mm -hmm. You don't have that time to reassess yourself. You know, once you're in, you're in. Mm -hmm. But now, even though this counter pick. Was the pretty good Diz's favorite. Yeah, Cobalt's well, still Cobalt able to play took, his game. Took two right, took yeah. two right off the bat. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, Ooh, great back air. Nice. That was, that was nice. Up there to back air. That's. I would say that's a nice back air. Yeah, I, I admire that. And there it goes, Nana. Oh, Did, oh no. It's a tad unfortunate. Yeah, but, you know, that's what's going to happen in this. Uh, I mean, you don't really see any fortunate SDs, but you know. No, I, I don't know. I, that one was. Quite unfortunate. I, I'm just saying, if, if I was Cobalt, I'd be like, wow, that's really fortunate for me, though. Still an unfortunate scenario. But I, yeah, I just won the set. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So, so. I'm in top eight. Yep, Winner's side. That's it. Shout outs to Cobalt for making yeah, it shout that far. Cobalt. Very good. Looking Having very good. Having fun this playing ice climbers. Yes. Not that a whole, not a whole lot of players uh -huh. can. It's very uh, commendable. Even, even like on the top 100, can't, a lot of players can't really say, you know, they enjoy that. Are we are we switching out? Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Sounds like we're switching out. Everyone, it's been fun. So, B Hawks, it's been a pleasure. It Everyone, has. Thanks very much for tuning in. We're gonna pass it off. All right. Sounds good. Yeah. What's up? Gims on the mic. You know what to do. Follow us and stuff. All Leftover Pound Apparel uh, is on this link. It's on, on GamingGen.com. JP3, best at what he does. You know what it is. Uh, we're getting two new casters, Fendic Lamar and Naku Garu. We'll be back in a second. Thank <laughs> you.